morning and I count this as a privilege to share a short devotional thought. I would like to turn our attention to Luke's Gospel chapter 10 verses 38 to 42. As Jesus and his disciples continued their way to Jerusalem, they came to a village where a woman named Martha welcomed them into her home. Her sister Mary sat at Lord's feet, listening to what he taught, but Martha was worrying over the dinner she was preparing. She came to Jesus and said, Lord, doesn't it seem unfair to you that my sister sits here while I do all the work? Tell her to come and help me. But the Lord said to her, my dear Martha, you are upset over these details. There is really one thing worth being concerned about. Mary has discovered it and I won't take it away from her. This is a very familiar passage to us and probably we have read it a number of times. And here we see that Jesus is actually coming to this village and Martha is actually welcoming Jesus to her home. It is Martha who is actually, you know, inviting Jesus to come into their home. And Mary and Martha both probably were very excited that Jesus is visiting the place and Martha is trying to do the best that she can, you know, to serve some of the best food, you know, to Jesus as he was visiting their home. She was busy with a number of things. Probably she was very good in carrying out the responsibilities, you know, to make sure that Jesus gets the best food at our home. I'm sure that all of us are like that in a way. We want to be the best that we can in our responsibilities. Probably as a parent, as a father, as a mother, as a sister, as a brother, as a sibling, or in our workplace, or maybe in our church, or in the community that we live in, we all want to do the best that we can, like how Martha thought that she was doing the best that she can to serve the Lord Jesus Christ. But in the middle of all these things, you see her sister, she is actually sitting at the feet of the Lord. And she was listening to what Jesus was teaching or what Jesus was talking there. It is Martha who invited Jesus to home, but it's Mary who is sitting at the feet of Jesus and listening to what Jesus was saying. In fact, Martha was so distracted with the things that were seems to be very, very good from her side so that she can serve the best for her master. I'm sure that we are all like that in many ways. You know, there are so many things that are so good around us. We want to do the best that we can because it looks good to us and we want to do those good things so that we can serve the best that we can to our master. But here's the thing, Mary chose what was better. The question I want to ask you this morning is, are we looking at those good things and are being distracted from actually from what we should be choosing, like how Mary was choosing? Mary chose what was better. Many times we are like Martha choosing good over the better. And this morning, I want to call you so that you would choose the best things in your life, like how Mary chose the best thing, to sit at the feet of the Lord. And that is what even the Lord told her, that she would not take that from her. This morning, may the Lord give us grace to choose the best things in our life, like how Mary chose the best thing for herself. Shall we pray? Dear Father, we thank you for this time. We thank you for your word and we thank you for this short meditation that you gave us. Lord, we know that we are so occupied with so many good things that we think in our life is good so that, Lord, we can serve you better. But, Lord, we thank you that you are reminding us about all those things. Lord, you want us to be like how Mary chose to be at your feet. Lord, we pray that you would give us grace and wisdom uh, to be at your feet to be at your presence, listening to you, more than trying to do all that we can with our skills and abilities. Thank you for this word that came to us this morning. Bless all those who are listening, O oh Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you and have a blessed day. God bless you. Mm -hmm.